Did you know that Frontiers of Pandora will have an online mode and you can even trade gear between other players? Avatar Theory here, hope you're doing well and having a fantastic day. And in this video, I want to talk about, well, basically how co-op will work in Avatar Frontiers of Pandora. So essentially, players will have the option to team up with a friend for an online co-op experience that allows them to jump in and out of the game whenever they want to. Although Game Informer didn't get a chance to try try out this feature themselves, the game was built with co-op play in mind right from the beginning as it's a fundamental part of the developer's vision. But before I continue, if you're new here and love everything Avatar related, then why not have a look at the rest of my channel and consider clicking that subscribe button as it really helps the channel. Now in this cooperative mode, two players can go through the entire adventure together. The second player keeps their character progress and to some extent the story development. How far the story progresses depends on whether both players are at the same point in the game's mission. If one player is just starting, they can team up with a friend who is further along in the game. However, they won't be able to participate in their friend's specific story missions. It is important to note though that co-op can only be done online and not through couch co-op. Additionally, players can exchange equipment with each other, so essentially trade gear. More experienced players can be generous and share rare and powerful weapons with their friends who can then use these items in their own single player game. This cooperative feature not only enhances the gameplay but also encourages teamwork and friendship between players making the game more memorable for everybody involved. Now although I do like the trading options, it will probably be exploited so in some sense if you're a starting player joining somebody that's already finished the game, they can probably give you some gear and weapons that's gonna be completely overpowering throughout the game. But to be fair, that happens in a lot of online games and as it stands there's no word on any co-op missions as in certain missions that can only be done with the co-op partner which is kind of a strange choice I was hoping there would be something equivalent to destiny's strike missions you know certain missions that has big boss battles maybe a certain amp suit or a certain difficulty amp suit that can only be destroyed with the co-op partner or essentially easier to destroy with the co-op partner and it is interesting that the developers stated that the game was made with co-op in mind right from the beginning when this is a single player story driven game. Now personally I would want to experience this game by myself first. Games like Gears of War I experienced with a friend because I feel that it was more designed to be experienced with somebody but Frontiers of Pandora I definitely want to play the entire campaign by myself just be fully immersed in the story instead of you know for example during an important or an emotional cutscene hear my friend chew on some Doritos or sipping some soda in the background because that will be highly distracting. I know the end game or basically what you do once you finish the campaign is take on hardcore fortresses so perhaps those fortresses will be easy to take down with a co-op partner and I can see where a co-op will be important then but as I said throughout the main campaign I will probably want to experience the game by myself maybe do a second playthrough with somebody right from the start but unfortunately as we know new game plus is not a thing at the launch of Frontiers of Pandora. But but as it stands, this is all we know about co-op in the game, so let me know in the comments below what you think of co-op. Is this something you want to try out? Do you want to play the game by yourself first and experience co-op at a later stage? Let me know in the comments below and for more Avatar content, have a look at the rest of my channel. Until next time, have a fantastic day and stay safe.